let's say you're about to walk into a business meeting. You need to make a sale, you need to solicit a client, or you need to apply for that job interview and you're walking in and you have those few minutes to spare. You're sitting in your car right before. How do you feel in those moments before? Very likely, you may feel anxiety, worry, fear, and you may doubt your capabilities and your worth. And you know that those feelings, which are natural, are the biggest obstacle and impediment to your success. Imagine you walk in and you're absolutely confident of yourself and you're just happy. You're not full of yourself, you're just a happy person. The aura is likely to get the other person to give you what you want. So how do we flip that switch? How do we become happy people? Let's see if we can take Judaism and instead of looking at it sometimes as a historic work, find the relevance of Judaism in our lives. I'll give you an example. We Jews pray every day. We daven and we say the Shema. In the Shema we say, I am Hashem your God who took you out of the land of Mitzrayim, the land of Egypt. Now, that's something which we say every morning, every evening. And it has a lot of historical value. Sure, this is what made us into a people. But actually, that's going to enable us to get out of our worries and troubles and concerns. So we're now holding in these parshias, we're reading about Hashem getting us out of Mitzrayim. When we learn about it, we want to actually experience it and feel it. What is Mitzrayim? Mitzrayim is the perspective that is constraining you. Mitzrayim means limitations. So if I'm feeling worried and anxious, that's my Mitzrayim. How do I get out of that Mitzrayim? Hashem says to Moshe, Go tell B'nai Yisrael, Lachain emor li B'nai Yisrael ani Hashem. Go tell them, I am Hashem. And I will take you out of the suffering of Egypt. He's not saying, go tell B'nai Yisrael that Hashem will take them out of Mitzrayim. He's saying, go tell them, I am Hashem. And then, you will no longer be in Mitzrayim. See, when we enter into that meeting, and we feel stressed, the reason is because we feel that we are the ones controlling the situation. And therefore, I don't know if this is going to work, because who says Hashem is going to give this to me? But if in real time, I can say, Ani Hashem, I feel that I am Hashem. So Hashem tells Moshe, go tell the Jews that all they need to do is to feel I am God. That means, instead of taking control and feeling like you're the one in charge here and you're doing it, that's what leads to the stress. Say, Hashem, you are in control. I'm giving this over to you. That's so tough. Because it almost feels like, then what do you, but Hashem is just going to take care of me? Yeah. Hashem says, all you need to do is tell me what you want. So I'm, I will take care of you. And Hashem says, if you know that you want, you need to succeed. This business deal, that one, Hashem will give you what you want in the end. And the moment we're able to give it over to God and say, God says he'll take care of me. He didn't say which business meeting will succeed, which interview will make it. He says that I'm going to succeed and I have nothing what to worry about. And the day, the moment I let go and I experience that's the moment of my salvation. That's the moment I get out of Mitzrayim. Now I'm no longer stuck. Walk into that business meeting with a feeling of God has my back. Absolutely. It's de stress. You gotta do that every single day, morning and evening, because we keep on stressing back just because we know it doesn't change the fact. 
So we daven every day. And every day we say, Shema Yisrael, Hashem Elokein, Hashem Echad, He's one. Nothing can harm me, nothing can hurt me. And we end off and we say, I am Hashem. And you've got to practice it in real time. When you're about to walk into the meeting, say, I have nothing what to worry about, nothing what to stress about. Hashem is here. And that feeling gets me out of my anxiety. Hence we daven. Hence we keep on speaking about it. It's yes, trying. It's the road to success. Just feel that Hashem is there. And then you're no longer in that anxiety, and then you succeed.